Yo, welcome Fernie. So yesterday was the first Queen Balandir spawn and we can see already crazy, crazy prices on those Archboss weapons. But killing Queen Balandir is actually not the only source on how to get your hand on those weapons. They can actually be crafted as well. To craft them, what you need are the Queen Balandir Soul Fragment. You can see that here is in the auction house many listings with even multiple pieces, even though we only had one Queen Balandir. That means there's also another way to farm those besides the Queen Balandir Archboss spawns. And this farm in theory works like this. You join Desert Caravan event. After 5 minutes, Queen Balandir will spawn as a non-targetable creature lasting for 10 minutes. It will rush through the sand and you will not have to follow it, but stay ahead of its path. Then at some point she will jump out of the ground. Be aware, this attack is knocking you back so you have to dodge it while simultaneously jumping in the middle of the dust she leaves behind. Cause there she will leave one of her Queen Balandir soul fragments behind. So it's time to spam F and pray to be the first cause it is like an ore so only the fastest person can get the reward. Even though the prices of this item are currently high in the auction house, I would only recommend it to do it in the early events or at night times. On other times of the day you have too much competition and the chance is too low to be one lucky one and you have to forfeit an event lose for it. Also I do not recommend you to buy any of those fragments at the moment. You need 180 pieces to craft it. So make sure you wait a bit until they go down and you can buy them at a reasonable price. Don't get baited yet. And now let's finish off the video with some gameplay of the first Queen Balandir kill in Europe. Za uwe fru ik ni maya nifta bang ting nikun ting nari tumpaya katos ake katos ekon talana weru tasi za uwe fru ik ni maya nifta bang ting nik 